Hey guys, it's Tim here and today I'll be reviewing Photo Studio AI, which is a digital platform that allows you to create professional quality profile pictures, Instagram pictures and other pictures from regular photos. So basically you use a photo, you upload that to this platform and it will put out uh, some cool pictures. Now, I'm going to let you be the judge because I'm going to show you live examples in case you're interested, check out the link in the description where you can get access to this platform. Also about the pricing, uh, some extra that you're going to get. So make sure to check that out. For now, let's dive into it and let me show you some examples that I created here with the platform. So as you can see here, these are the photos that I already have generated with the platform. So let's go from left to right. So actually i took pictures of myself and from my wife and let me show you the original picture here this is the original picture that i uploaded here and i said hey create a linkedin picture from my wife picture that you're seeing right here at the left side so uh, i can see personally that this is not exactly her and what you will notice with the pictures is that the pictures will be way more smooth than the original pictures which is basically a good thing but i think when you're really close to a person you see the difference now maybe you say hey they look exactly the same that's why i said i'm gonna let you be the judge the quality though is very good but this is the picture that it created then we got pictures of myself here so uh, these are different ones so this is one let me actually show you a few this is one, this one, and this is one that has been created. And the original picture that I used for this one here was this picture. So let me zoom in again so that you can see it. So this was the original picture that you're seeing right here at the left side. And it created this picture. And then also this is the other picture that it created from my uh, profile picture. So you can put them in any scene basically and then the next one here is it created this picture here as a LinkedIn profile picture from my original picture here. Now what I'm going to do right now uh, because these pictures were all taken from a laughing picture where you can see my teeth etc. What I'm going to do here um, is I'm going to show this photo where I just have my mouth mouth closed because they say that you basically uh, need to upload the pictures like this and then i'm going to show you how you can how this actually works so to do so you first need to upload your picture it's a three-step system here so you basically here you upload a photo then you choose your style and then you can watch them in your photo so let me upload the other picture so this is how it works so first you choose your photo so let's say this is the photo that i want to use right now where i'm not laughing here i'm going to click on open and this is the photo here and then the only thing that you need to do here is you need to say is this a male or a female so i'm going to click next and now it's processing my photo now this will take a couple of seconds 10 20 30 seconds before i can continue but let's come back when it's finished and there you go it is finished and this is the next screen so here it's asking me choose your style and there are two styles to choose from so you can choose linkedin style or an instagram style so let me actually first do the linkedin then the instagram and then let me also show you some other examples so when i click on linkedin style here the only thing that i need to do is to click on generate image and it will cost one credit now on the sales page you can see exactly how many credits you'll get for what price etc but one thing that i need to point out is that this software is not something that you're going to say hey i'm just going to push 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 with all different tests test images etc because it, the, the the credits are quite expensive uh, but the quality is high of the pictures so it requires a lot of rendering in the background etc and that's why you cannot push hundreds of photos through this uh, just to test you just need to sell this to somebody else say hey give me your picture i'm gonna uh, give you good quality profile pictures and you can charge for it the funny thing is that the product creator sold a bunch of these things through whatsapp of everyone requesting their photo to have a photo created professional profile picture created by the vendor Anker himself let's go back and let's see what the result is and there you go and 
this is the end result that it created. So this was the original picture here. This is me and it created this it's a high quality profile picture here that you can upload to your LinkedIn profile uh, as a profile picture. So the LinkedIn profile picture will always look like the one that you're seeing here. Now, when I scroll down here and you go to the bottom here, uh, you can redo this if you want to make a new one. If you're not satisfied, you can uh, redo this. You can also upload another input image or you can download this to your computer or you can continue with two other options. So here you can also create an Instagram image or a custom prompt. So first let's create an Instagram image uh, from my photo. So here again, it's going to render this process. Uh, it's taking the original picture again. It's going to create an Instagram photo. Now I'll be back after about three minutes when the photo is ready. And here's the picture that has been created for Instagram. As you can see, this is a different setting here. This is not a profile picture, but more like a uh, living environment here. And again, this is the original picture here. You can compare these two. And like I said, I'm going to let you be the judge here. Uh, this is what it created. So you can create LinkedIn pictures, you can create Instagram pictures, but here's also an option here to do custom prompts. So when I click on this option here, you could do Instagram style prompt, LinkedIn professional prompt, or enter your own custom prompt. So when you click on Instagram style prompts here, uh, you get a bunch of pre-done prompts for you that you can use. So for example, Sunset Beach Vibes is the one that I used here for uh, this picture here. This is the Sunset uh, vibes, the beach vibes. Um, so you can do all these different uh, options here, or you can write one yourself. So basically, this is a pre-done prompt for you. So when I, let's say a cozy cafe uh, generate a warm and inviting image in a trendy cafe setting, ideal food bloggers and coffee enthusiasts. So when I click on generate image here, it will create an image in that setting. And again, it's going to use the original profile picture here again. Now each generation costs about two, three minutes, depending on how busy the server is. So keep in mind that it takes a few minutes to render. Here's the result. And there you go. Here's the result uh, where I'm sitting in a cafe here. Um, let me see here. Yeah, the fingers are matching. Let me see if this is, yeah, here you see a little bit of off with the fingers as you can see here. This one is correct here. You see a little uh, thing that is not matching. So you need to redo this. The funny thing is it kept the hoodie on here. So we can try to create something else. But as you can see with the LinkedIn pictures, it took a suit, uh, it put a suit on me. Uh, but yeah, you can redo it again and again. So let's go to another one here, custom prompts. And let's say we're going to do an Instagram style prompt here. So let's say I want to do something in neon lights, uh, inspired portrait with a neon lights and urban nightscape, ideal for music and entertainment influencers. Um, let's also uh, put on a t-shirt. Let's see, let's say a pink pink t-shirt. Let's see if it also is able to do this prompt. Let's generate the image and let's see what it creates here. And there you go. Here we go. <laughs> Look what it created here. So it also added the picture of me here on his t-shirt. Uh, but yeah, this is what it created. It did actually put on a pink shirt, but somehow it kept this hoodie on so i recommend you to not put a hoodie on when you take or upload your picture because it's it's adding that hoodie again on this picture which is kind of cool but uh yeah this is the end result it put on a pink shirt as you can see here uh but this is the end result now let's do one more and then with linkedin again so let's do a linkedin here um let's do you know let's do the other one no here, financial, educational, profess, professional, warm kind of knowledge, uh, doo -doo -doo. remote, uh, let's see here. Let's do a legal, legal expert here. Let's generate an image here for this one. Let me show it when it's finished. And there you go. 
let's see what it is here yeah so the hoodie kind of puts me off um to have that hoodie on all the time probably i should have uh, mentioned that in the prompt but yeah like i said just put on a shirt or something else so that you don't have a hoodie on the pictures i think personally this picture has been the best of all looking at my face i think this face matches the most with my own face uh, but that's basically what photo studio ai is all about i think it's a cool platform what i personally like about the platform is that it focuses on one thing like being a photo studio create professional photos for uh, other business owners, people that like to have profile pictures on uh, LinkedIn, on Instagram, etc., that you can sell as a photo studio. So you can sell those high quality photos. Do I like the pictures of myself? Um, I, the last one, honestly, I, I like the face because it, it came pretty close. But looking at myself, having an, an image generated of myself, you all, always see the flaws in pictures. So maybe you can bump into that. What I said before, the product owner uh, has sold a lot of these pictures because people requested those pictures. Uh, and you can definitely sell this. I believe that you can sell this. I like that it is one platform focusing on one thing only, and that's creating those pictures. It is credit-based, so you can't run hundreds of images without spending money on it. Uh, at the other hand, I think that's a good thing because you just pay for what you use, uh, and you can always purchase extra credits as well now during the launch you will get extra credits as well uh every detail is on the page again check out the link in the description below for all the details regarding what you're going to get what's included the pricing etc and if you have any questions make sure to ask them in the comments below also hit a thumbs up if this video was useful to you uh, make sure to subscribe to my youtube channel if you haven't done yet i do a lot of product reviews marketing products all kinds of products so uh, if you're interested in that, make sure to subscribe, hit the notification bell so that you get notified each time I upload a new review. And for now, thank you so much for watching and I uh, hope to see you in my next video. Talk soon. Cheers.